Hi guys, welcome back to another Army Paint For You video. Uh, in this video I just want to uh, showcase uh, some of the work I've been doing with the Hearst Arts molds that I've received. Um, I've ordered a number of molds um, from Hearst Arts. Uh, this particular one is the water cavern piece, uh, the floors, the water cavern walls themselves, and the accessory molds. Uh, you got a lot of options with these things guys, they're great. If you haven't checked it out, I definitely suggest that you go to uh, herstarts.com and have a look at what he has to offer there's a little bit of everything there for for anybody's taste really you can do stuff for space hulk uh, dungeons and dragons fantasy uh there's some other great guys that have been doing some fantastic work with this stuff highly recommend you check check out uh terranscapes.com he does a lot of stuff with her starts molds just beautiful beautiful stuff guys um you've got so many possibilities you can really bring your game to life no matter what it is um, in my case for this i'm going to be using it not only for dnd &D, but i'm also going to be modifying some of the pieces to use with 28 mil uh, afghanistan uh, to help model some caves so we can fight some conflicts right inside the caves themselves so there's, there's really no limit to what you can do here guys um, his space hulk stuff uh, bruce has made done a fantastic job highly detailed if you like space hulk you definitely got to get these molds and start cranking out some pieces because I'll tell you something right now it's a lot better than playing on cardboard guys um, the paint job you see here is just uh, straightforward dry brushing guys uh, I'm not the world's best painter by any means um, I'm really not that good at all actually it uh, it's just simple simple uh, tactics that work the best sometimes guys you just dry brush uh, I'm gonna get in a little bit more with another video showing you what I did with a couple of the pieces. You can't really see it in this video, but a couple of the cavern pieces. Uh, if you can see a little bit of sheen there. Um, I've treated them with a little bit of Mod Podge just to give the effect that, uh, you know, the rocks are wet, moist from being in the cavern. Uh, it's easy, it's quick, so I'll show you a little bit later on about that. Uh, just how to, how to get that look uh, and, uh, you know, really set those pieces off, give them an effect of uh, reality. So... Thanks for stopping in guys, stay tuned to the channel, I'm going to have another update uh, coming shortly on the D-Day board, it's progressing well and uh, obviously as you can see there's going to be some more uh, Her Start stuff being pumped out, so if you have any questions or comments leave them below and uh, thanks a lot for joining me guys, have a good one. 